Trippy trip today, look at that. Fresh, oh. looking fresh, dude. I'm a, yeah, I'm a bit of a purple tiger today. You know, I'm in my feelings, but I'm also very aggressive. So, best of both worlds. Yeah, shout out VHTS code Nikki10. I believe that's correct. I think it's like 10% off, something like that. Look at this. Biceps not included, folks. Glutes, dude. Walking in mud. <laughs> Started coming as an assistant coach, to Mr. JB, for the white belt classes. Yeah, Monday and Wednesday, I help walk around, help people, help teach them classes as well. JB's doing a really good job of, uh, you know, with the curriculum for these for these white belts, and uh, they're definitely getting better. You've been working out a bunch too, man. Yes, yeah, finally started lifting and doing some rehab stuff. Uh, I definitely needed it. And JB's running me through some rehab stuff as well as just some general lifting stuff. They also added in the assault bike, which is literally the worst experience of my life. I'm on like the verge of throwing up every single time. It's the, it's the fucking dream of it. It's over. It's over pretty fast though. So afterwards, like, oh, fuck, like, I can do it again. Yeah. Yeah. I did not feel that way today. I vomited. <laughs> oh, it was bad. Afterwards, I was like, oh. there's some puke left on his rash guard. No, right no, here. no, no. I was not wearing this. Look at that. That's hard work, vomit. <laughs> I change clothes after no, I no, no, no. sweat and puke sometimes. <laughs> Yeah, his, his biceps are getting close to one of my biceps. Oh, both of them combined. Yeah, yeah. Both, both of his arms, that sounds like all that's like one Let's see him next to each other. <laughs> yoked. Look at, look at Nikki Ryan here. Yeah. Right? Flex now. Yeah, but it's tough. He's not sleeveless here. He's still getting pretty big. What, what, what's, what's the, the uh, weight difference? Do we know? 185. Look at the look at Shit. look at the biceps now though. He's got cannons. Shit. Where are they bigger? That's the debate we're having. The light, the light, you know, the angle. You can't really tell who's the bigger person there. <laughs> yeah. I mean, look at the, the hair's different, know. bro. How are you gonna tell? Couldn't tell you exactly. That <laughs> it might honestly be photoshopped, dude. Mm -hmm. I know, it looks like my head was shrunk. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, you're right. Fuck. <laughs> It might actually be bigger there. I see up from bottom, he collar ties me, I go wrist to the elbow. I bring that forearm to, towards my hip. As I bring my foot towards the outside, he pulls away. I switch to a cuffing grip in the armpit. And again, and I get shoulder to shoulder connection. As he continues to pull away, I start heisting up and get behind my opponent. One, two, three. Today we are working from the bottom, right? Preferably I'm a top guy, but when I feel necessary, I'll, I look to heist up from bottom position. I usually take down every body that I want to take down. But when it comes to pulling guard, sometimes it's easier to, to get the sub, because the opponent's more enticed to come on top and start attacking if you take a defensive posture first. You know, I'm an offensive kind of guy, so it's a bit hard, for, a bit out of my element, but still I'm world class at it. Coming up from bottom, getting on top, staying on top. That's it. I go elbow wrist. As I lean back, I bring this forearm towards my hip. From here, I scoot under his hips and I start elevating him. As I do so, I extend my right leg as I push this elbow across my, across my center line and I'm able to access the back. So. <laughs> it feels like you're so close when you, when you press that up. It's yeah. right here. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. If he's here, but if he he can jump over me. Yeah, this is a good jump over. I'd have to cut that off before you can help. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna posture up too. Like, Damien's back. Where you been, I'm man? Back, man. I was traveling. I was in Vegas for a bit. Got some good MMA training out there. Brandon Moreno, right? Yeah, did some grappling with Moreno. How was that? 
Oh, it was good, man. You know, he's a hard worker. Maybe like four of us, and then we were all just doing jujitsu. Just wanted to, he just wanted to uh, increase his grapple. Uh, I got to train with a guy named Patchy Mix. He's uh, about to fight for the belt in Bellator. Really good jujitsu, actually. Um, so he'll be fighting for a million dollars, I think, this week, <laughs> this weekend. So good luck to you, buddy. What do you have upcoming, man? I have a Muay Thai tournament in June, so uh, about like two, three months out, or three months out from that, and then I'll do my pro debut in August for MMA, and then uh, I'll be taking MMA fights as, as frequently as I can after that. Is that going to be through Fury? It's going to be through Fury, yeah. Okay. So pretty much going to get my development through Fury, uh, and then you know once I get like five to seven fights, I'll end up going to a bigger organization like Bellator or uh, uh, something like that. What'd you say? <laughs> Get up. He comes up to me, he's like, he wants to catch this fade, I'll beat your ass right now. <laughs> Hell yeah. We're gonna get back to Damien. Got <laughs> important stuff coming up. Most people don't just fucking I saw yesterday Craig made some videos with some lady boys, and so the assumption is I think that might have resulted in him not being able to get off the toilet this morning, and so he asked me to come and cover him. I was more than happy to. We're um, been very blessed today because uh, God has taken out Craig, and we've actually got uh, some decent jujitsu being shown for once out here. Joseph Chen taking over. We lost Craig to the Lady Boys last night. Um, thankfully, Joseph's out here funding his trip by being a Lady Boy himself. So he knocked off early this morning, and he's been uh, teaching us some um, butterfly guard trickery today. So, like I said, it's nice to actually get some decent technique happening out here instead of Craig's bullshit and bullying and his banter. My mouth is fucking dry. <laughs> Bro, you kept spitting on the A. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. He's a spitter. Spitters are quitters. <laughs> Tyler with his old trusty water bottle. Bro, you know when I got this. It's called B-Team Lost and Found? <laughs> <laughs> Actually? Man, this thing could survive a nuclear bomb for sure, bro. I you gotta have that. Lost that. And found? He was like, that, it's uh, been here two weeks. I'm gonna tape it and make mine. it my that's own. Is that cool? I was like, yeah, mine. bro, go with that's it. These great. losers can't keep their shit. Okay. It's their problem. That's it, man. That's it. <laughs> Don't leave your shit around. Yeah. What do you want? <laughs> Craig's a lazy fuck, you know? Really. Bro, you're holding the fort for him, man. If you weren't here, I don't even know what would happen. At least now that yeah, you're here, Craig. we're actually gonna learn something. Yeah, yeah man. <laughs> Craig's a piece of shit. Taking everything you worked for, motherfucker. <laughs> next time, bro. Next time is the Joseph Cam. Joseph Cam. No, I'm, I'm gonna request the shares and absolutely. Yeah, that's it. That's yeah. it. This is my payment for this. Gotta get paid. All these guys are gonna want you. Hey. <laughs> this is a much better. Why? Why is that true? All these years. And then you go back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's really I started training like a week before. <laughs> <laughs> Preparation. Hold on to you. Yeah, you're too what? Too spazzy. Too spazzy. I'm too spazzy. Too I, spazzy. I don't want to change my ways. He's too feeble. Feeble? Yeah. yeah. We both small. have feeble knees. Don't come on. Dude, my knees are indestructible. They're, they've been destructed. No. Yes. Uh oh. The new move I came up with. My counter. Who heel hooks who? Dude, Ethan's never hit a heel hook in his Bro, life. I heel hook everyone all the time. Dude, this, right? this guy is. Every single competition he's ever had is him on the verge of getting heel hooked. That's not true! It is! That's not true! It is! Oh. Fabricio. 
That's one. Congratulations. <laughs> That's one that matters, all right? That's rule number one. Don't drink coffee on the mats unless you own the gym. Yes. That's right. First off, it's a very good thing that Craig Jones isn't here because we would be getting ripped apart by him for drinking one of these. We got the second best item on the Starbucks menu. This is the vanilla cream cold brew. The number one spot is held by the pumpkin cream cold brew. And if you disagree, you're a culinary child. You have no taste buds. <laughs> no, it's, it's three. So Sal, you, and Bobby. And Bobby. Alright guys, everyone listen up! Alright, guys, we're gonna we're gonna have like normal training and everything, but afterwards stick around. We're gonna do a uh, little challenge here. We're gonna do a tug of war. Our guy Nicky Rod, okay, thinks he can take on three about 145ers, 155ers. So we got Sal, alright, Sally Hastings. Hey, <laughs> alright, no, no way in. Do we take them at their word? We got our guy Frankie. And last but certainly not least, Mr. Bobby Sandu. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, yes, stick around, get your, get your training in, everything uh, as usual, and then after we're gonna cheer we're gonna All right. Go. You gotta warm up, you gotta warm up. What do you think we're saying? Uh, wait, wait, a bunch of dumb yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> 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 when they're walking around screaming like this, there's no smart things being said. Who do you think? Who do you think wins the challenge? Nicky Rod or our three guys? The three guys. The three guys. All right, Nicky. Listen, if Bobby Sandu wasn't on the team, I'd probably be picking the three guys. But Bobby is like, he's like dead, negative dead legs. Weight. Yeah, 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 he's yeah. like negative legs. You know, he takes away. Like just <laughs> the two of them would be better without Bobby. Uh, but since he's in there, I'm gonna have to go with Nicky Rod. Who we got? You guys, you guys confident? We, we, oh, we get to fucking We get to choose. Oh. Obviously, I'm gonna bet on myself. Okay, I was just trying to see if there's some unwavering. I could be, I could be Nick Rod alone without Bobby and. Well, Frankie. you maybe average up. He's right behind no, you. No, no, we're all. Oh, hey, J Dog, listen. who you got? These three are the monster. Mm, I'm gonna say them three. Ooh. Have, you guys have six legs. It doesn't make sense why I should win. Exactly. But I mean, regardless, I surprise all of them. It don't make no sense. I shouldn't be able to beat y'all. So when it happens, it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be. It's gonna be fun. And who you got? I'm about to roll with them, so I pick Nick. Okay, Nick, you're all right. Who do you have? Me? Let's not let him hear us. So Nikki's cornering them right now. So honestly, honestly, I think I got the three. I think if, if they coordinated together like they're trying to do right now, I think we got it. So right now, as you see, we got we got our great mind, Nikki Ryan, in their corner. He's basically telling them to 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 coordinate. Go one, two, pull. One, two, pull. Because if they go messy, they don't stand a chance. Nikki Rod's one coordinated monster. He's one person. He doesn't have to communicate. So. Honestly, not it's not their strong suit, so, you know, they got more legs, but less brains. I, I did a few things in preparation. I wrung out my sweaty rash guard on their side, so they're nice and moist to have the leftover residue of the bee cream. I also air blew my side, right? I, I, uh, I dried it up a little bit, so I should have a bit more traction. I might have to break out some super glue for my feet. Maybe I'll toss the wrestling shoes on. Wish me the best. Any final thoughts here, guys? Yeah. We got this. We got our strategy down, you know, we got the mats. One bamboo dry. is weak. Multiple bamboos is strong. Apes together Genghis. strong. Genghis. You should be in the red corner. You shouldn't be in the blue. Not just reviewing the enemy. Y'all better pull hard. Scouting. We got technique. You have power, we have technique. I have uh, accuracy. He was in the coast guard. <laughs> he used to climb ropes all day, up and down. Yeah, we, we watched Squid Game too. You might. You might mess this up. No way. Trip over your own feet. <laughs> no, I would not. Yeah, people are calling you the weakest link, Bobby. Oh, no. What? I disagree. Thank you. I think you're the anchor. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Oh, well, I'm the anchor. I would never let my team down. I'm definitely down. the anchor. I would not let my team down. And I have leverage. Usually, Bobby and I are enemies, but today we're teammates. We're teaming up. And, and family. For the greater foe. <laughs> for the greater foe. Are you ready? Round are you ready? one. Go! Fight! I think I won. 
shit. <laughs> oh <laughs> shit, it ripped! It ripped! Look! It fucking ripped! <laughs> Holy shit! We broke your shit off. No, I, I broke We broke your shit off. <laughs> Alright, we need a we need a rope. Cut. This is not gonna work. You're I best. think you guys you were, were gonna get it. So what do you guys think? If it didn't if it didn't break, who would've won? But why did it break? It broke because I because I dropped them. It's still bad. It was in direction. Again, round two. Round two. It's going first. Ready? Yeah, well. Yes. Yeah, That's a Coast Guard nut. Okay. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Tied round yourself twice. Okay. Ten check. Three. Round two. two. One. Go. Fight. Let's go. Two out of three, two out of three. Yeah, give me two of them. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna skip off of this. Okay, do, do you guys think you can still win with only two? Yeah, yeah. Who do you kick out? I kick Bobby out. I'm not in Bobby. Okay, Bobby out. All right. So this is round two. Nikki Rod has one life left. So we retied the ropes because they exploded one, and now we got rid of Bobby because he uh, didn't help much on the first one, apparently. Okay, three, two, Final. one, go. Fight. Oh! Wow! No! 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 Three v one. That's a common man one to yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. Give us three for the. Give us a break. All right, well, what went wrong? If you noticed earlier in the match, they cheated. They oh, cut the rope, so when I was yeah, winning, it's it, it split in half. <laughs> what more do you want to say? You're cheaters. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have some serious accusations. How do you guys, Sal? Get in here. How, how, how do you guys feel? Today about was these? a day for the Fuck people. Frankie's the MVP yeah. on that that's one. Right. Yeah, that's right. There's also cameras everywhere, and you can see before yeah, yeah. our match. Yeah. And that guy's clearly on steroids. out his rash guard on our side. That guy. They're too diverse to be truthful. Whoa. <laughs> you see this Coast Guard knot right here? This is some. It's a bowling. <laughs> wow. You ever see a bowling? A thing of beauty right there. I totally have under brown belt off the back. That was... Bro. You're getting, what a, you're getting demoted. You what were so bad guy. you got kicked off by your own. <laughs> so even that, I wanted to join Nicky Rod's team. They the literally won easier without you. He was fatigued. You're like negative half a person. He was fatigued. <laughs> you're the worst person. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Nicky, tell him. I guess not. Nicky Rod only lost because he's natural and they're all on sauce. That's it. <laughs>